OSHA's Hazard Communication, or HAZCOM standard, does not apply to employees using consumer products if the duration and frequency of exposure is comparable to typical consumer use. Even employees who handle chemicals in packages can be covered. For example, retail and warehouse workers who stock consumer products are handling chemicals beyond typical consumer use, and they would be covered. An OSHA letter of interpretation from 2005 described two situations that help clarify the consumer product exemption. The letter first described employees using paint, adhesive, and thinners to create visual aids for presentations. Now, OSHA could not determine if their exposure was more than typical consumer use, but OSHA did say that if the employees are routinely exposed to these chemicals, they would be covered by HASCOM and they would need training. The letter then asked about employees who use cleaning products at their own workstations. Again, the employer must evaluate exposure, but OSHA noted that cleaning a personal workstation was not a job requirement. So employees who occasionally wipe down their desks and keyboards probably meet the exemption because their exposure should be comparable to typical consumer use. If so, they would not fall under the HASCOM standard. 